Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. So today we're gonna be doing a full face of She Glam makeup. Look at all these. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna dive into this and just see if it's actually worth the money or not. All right, so the first thing of course is, you know, the primer and they have two different primers that they sent me, which you have the She Glam Birthday Skin Primer Pigment Perfector. So this yellow one and you have this beautiful pink one, which this is the Birthday Skin Primer Smoothing Rose. But since I have a lot of texture, I think I'm gonna go with the Birthday Pigment Perfector, like this one, this one. These products are not that expensive, but they're still a luxurious feel to it and there's a little spatula which is super amazing open it up look at that it's like transforming into my skin tone and it's like hiding my acne do you see that so far, um, I would feel like this product is really cool, number one, because it changes color and it feels pretty good on the skin. Like it's really hydrating. There's not really that much fragrance. It doesn't burn my skin, so that's a plus. Because <laughs> sensitive skin over here and low, everything burns on here. So you're ready to go towards foundation, which I have two foundations from She Glam again. And I wasn't sure which one I wanted to go with. We've got the She Glam Complexion Pro Long Lasting Breathable Matte Foundation or Matte however you say it. And we have the She Glam Skin Finite Hydrating Foundations. Mm, so I'm gonna go with this one, the black one, cause hello, the packaging on these ones. Okay, I kinda cheated a little bit. I decided to open the packaging before I could show you guys just to see. Little palm, so that's cute. Okay. Okay, okay. Um, why is this foundation so good though? Like why? Is it a combination of the primer and the foundation? Because I'm telling you guys, my face is flawless, okay? And it's not, like it says that it is a long lasting breathable matte foundation. Honestly, the coverage that it gives with such little products is just insane. Did you see this? Like I barely put, I think I put like two pumps and it doesn't look heavy and it doesn't look cakey on my face, which is um weird. Hello, like She Glam, where are you coming from? Next product is obviously the contour and the blush. So we've got the She Glam Sun Sculpt Liquid Contour in Golden Sun. And again, the packaging is super cute, guys. Like, look at this fanciness with the applicator that is so weird. It smells like vanilla i was like maybe it's not gonna be that dark but hello okay, i'm just applying little dots like on tiktok oh my god i'm such a tiktok girl i'm trying to be a baddie okay <laughs> at least we got the concealer if ever it goes wrong okay that's not that bad actually to blend it's just i can't leave it for too long because if not it's gonna dry in a little dot <laughs> on my skin with that foundation right now it looks kind of reddish as if i got sunburn on my skin what do we think so far i think it's a pretty good color it looks it looks kind of good. Oh, we're going to the blush that went everywhere on TikTok. Like it was literally everywhere. Because one, it's cute. The applicator is amazing because it's the same one as the contour shade. And the package is just cute. And the colors are cute as well. I think I took a shade that was way too dark for me. Devoted. That looked kind of scary. What am I going to do with this? Oh, that is so pigmented. Maybe I should have done like one. Oh, do you guys see this? This is so pigmented. Okay, I'm just gonna blend it out all the way up to my under eye because that's the new trend. Yeah. Like, why is it so good? Like, this is not okay. Like, this is not okay. <laughs> oh my God. I love liquid cream products right under powder because it just looks so beautiful and it creates a flawless base. All right, now it's time to set the face and I have this from She Glam. I did a video um, a while ago. I don't remember when, but this is the setting powder that they have. So this is the Insta Ready Face and Under Eye Setting Powder Duo. So I'm gonna use this little one for my under eyes and then the loose powder for all over my face. Obviously the powder them down a little bit of everything, but the sad part is I don't have any powdered blush or anything powder. So that's the look for today. Maybe later on I'm gonna add some things on my face, but uh, since it's a full face of She Glam, we're gonna keep with She Glam, okay? I have a little bit of a bare brow situation right now, so I wanna do the brows. I do have multiple brow products. So this is the She Glam Brows on Demand 2-in-1 Brow Pencil, and then we have the Feather Better Liquid Eyebrow Pencil, which I feel like this one reminds me a little bit of the Benefit, you know, brow pen. It's just this one is a little bit more cheap on the outside packaging. And it creates like really tiny strokes, which I love. I think I'm gonna try this one right here. And I feel like I prefer this packaging a little bit more. We've got this feathered brow situation and we have this pencil. And I chose the shade uh, 
hope. Maybe I'm gonna be shook just like the other products that I just tried. Okay, I can be, you know, a little heavy handed with this one. I mean, the pencil side so far looks really good and it looks quite natural too. Look at those brows that need some loving on the side. And it's waxy hard enough so it doesn't like go everywhere. You can be kind of precise with it. I think it's pretty nice. It's a pretty nice product for a two in one. So I shaded with this side, which is a little bit lighter than the liquid part. And then I add some hair strokes to that side. Brows are done and I'm like, oh my God, we should do the eyes now because we have a whole thing for the eyes. We've got this chromosome collection, which, oh, I am so excited to be trying this out because there's so many great colors. Like I put a neon shirt just for this occasion because I was like, it's summer and we need to do all this chroma type of thing. And I kind of like that it opens up like this. Like, look at this. It is so so cool. You got the eyeshadows, you got a highlighter here, and then, because we didn't have any other highlighter, <laughs> and we've got some eye kind of paints, some eye pencils, so this is going to be great to do the eyes with. And we have these two, we have Velocity here, and we have Time Warp here. <laughs> so Time Warp looks like this. There's some yellow, green, blue, and there's some nice stems too, like, whoops. And then the other one, yeah, it's a little bit more purplish, gr like orangey, and it just looks really good overall. So I'm like, which one should I take? Maybe I should do a mix of both. I think I'm gonna go with the, you know, golden type of shades. Golden type of shades, yes. And oh, the highlighter, but this I can just put it later. Oh, I feel like I wanna try it now because I'm almost done with my face. So let me try this. It looks white, but then on the brush, it looks totally pink. I mean, it's pretty nice, it's pretty nice, but it kind of doesn't fit with the blush that I have <laughs> at the moment. It doesn't fit, but we're trying, we're trying things out. Okay, so I put, you know, everything goes wrong for a reason. <laughs> so I put a little bit of, you know, my eye primer and then it was kind of weird. So I decided to correct it a little bit with the other She Glam powder that I have. This is in the shade Biscay. Since there is a little bit of color, I was like, oh, maybe it's gonna cancel out whatever happened with eye primer. But now it looks pretty good, so. I don't want too intense. Um, I want to stay within those golden areas where my eyes kind of pop. And I'm taking a little tiny fluffy, br fluffy brush and I'm going to go with that brown shade right here. It's kind of dark, but that's going to be a transition shade. <laughs> and I can light it up, lighten it up with some, you know, setting powder. So we'll see how this one blends on my eyes. Because I never tried the She Glam eyeshadows. I mean, that shade isn't that bad if you just, you know, blend it out properly. It's not like the most pigmented, you know, pigment that I've ever tried, but it's buildable. The eyeshadow is not that bad, but it's kind of patchy. <laughs> the matte eyeshadows are not it. I think, I think I'm going to go still with that grain shade, adding a little bit of depth and dimension. Going into grains, because I usually never go into grains. I guess we're going to risk it. So the little green. And I'm just putting it into the outer corner, like right here. I mean, it's kind of okay, but on my eyes, I don't think I'm vibing. I don't think I'm vibing. And I'm gonna take this beautiful, it's like, it looks green, but it looks golden on my arm. This is like a shimmer shade. I'm gonna put this on my eyes. Okay, by its own, like it looks pretty nice, to be honest. That's a pretty good, sh cool shade. So now I'm gonna go with the other eyeshadow palette because I'm starting to look kind of crazy and I'm gonna take this light gold and put it in the inner corner. Lighten this up, baby, lighten this up. The Opal Essence, the white one. It's not just white, okay. I'm putting a little brush and I'm gonna go and with a brush, putting it in the inner corner. You know what? These are pretty cool. At least there's some green in it. It fits with the eyeshadow look. Oh yeah, we had like the liners to try. Which one should I try? There's so many. I'm gonna take the gold one to add it to where the gold is because I wanna see what's the color of this one. It literally looks like it's the eyeshadows but in different orders. <laughs> It's the same thing, like, hello, I have a great mind. So what do we think so far? I think it's okay, it's okay. <sighs> oh my God, okay, so the next thing is we're gonna get some mascara and you saw this everywhere. This was the Stay Wild She Glam All-in-One Volume and Length Mascara. And apparently this was crazy. So I'm gonna be trying this out on my lashes. So we got the volume and the length. This side. It's, it's nice. It doesn't give me as much volume as I would think, 
but we're gonna try it with this side. I feel like this one is to really separate and add a little bit of length to the lashes. I feel like I like my lashes the way they are because I did have a bunch of, you know, eyelashes that are cute, but I think I wanna keep them since I like this mascara so much. It's really opening up my eyes a lot. We're gonna keep it, we're gonna keep it that way and we're gonna jump straight to the lips. I have a few products. I have this Velvet Matte Lip Liner and I chose the Concrete Jungle Color. This was a very popular shade, so that's why I took it, which I wish it would like sharpen itself, but you can't have everything, you know what I mean? <laughs> this color, you guys, this color is literally everything. Do you see this? Oh my God. This is my perfect shade. This is my perfect shade. I cannot believe it. This is insane. Insane, this is, oh my God. I didn't think I would like a color that much, but this is definitely my new favorite shade for lip liner, especially when I want to do a neutral look. So we've got two things. We've got a lip tint that is way too dark for this. This is um, Love No Tap, and that's a lip tint. So that's gonna be way, way, way too dark for what I'm currently going for. So we're gonna avoid this one, and I'm gonna go with the Jelly Wow. This was also all over TikTok, and this is a, a hydrating lip oil, which I kind of need at the moment. Look at this cute little thingy. Oh. And the applicator is so big, so juicy. That's what people are putting everywhere on their faces. So the vibe that it gives me, the texture is like a candy. There's some strings <laughs> of this thing. Um, but overall, it's a pretty nice product. I like it. Okay, so my thoughts after using all of the products below that we saw in this video, I feel like She Glam is so such a great brand. I don't know if you guys remember, but the first brand that I ever ordered online was like literally e.l.f. cosmetics. And I feel like She Glam right now is the new e.l.f. of the day. You know, like everything was inexpensive and then you could have like some type of payoff. Of course, like e.l.f., you know, the increase their quality and everything. But She Glam at the very moment, that's what it reminds me of. It's like the new e.l.f. cosmetics. And it's like products that are not expensive, but that can perform, except maybe for like the eyeshadow look. I love them most, I think is the lip liner, just from the color, the, the texture by itself, I think is too creamy for me. I absolutely love the foundation. I was so shook. Like, what is this? Sorcery, it is insane. And then we have the two, you know, blush and contour duo. What is this? Like, why is it so good? I don't understand. And even the brow product, my brows are snatched, everything is snatched, and it just looks amazing. And we're in a chroma type of thing from the chroma collection from the eyeshadow. So liquid eyeshadows were great. The uh, eyeliners were great as well. It looks really great. Um, other products that I didn't try are these two things right here, which this is the All Eyes On You Eyelash Glue Liner. But um, overall, I feel like it's a great line. And the lashes, I feel like they're gonna be great, great, great. If you look at it, there's a lash applicator in this pack. Also, there's like some butterflies on here, which is super cute. Two pairs of butterflies. One pair with some pink at the top, which I'm gonna be wearing this one for sure. Oh, and even guys, the birthday Skin primer, this one, why? Like this was kind of like, you know, removing the redness from my skin because it was kind of turning my skin color, which again, if you're in a hurry one day, you have a little bit of redness on your skin, you wanna get rid of this, this is just amazing. And this paired with this, oof, your skin is gonna look flawless, okay? like. Look at this. Anyways, I really recommend She Glam. I think it's a great brand overall. If you want like, you know, to give makeup to someone and I just feel like this is just great. You know, like if somebody's starting in makeup as well, it's easy to like buy a few things and try a few different things because there's products that just work and that look amazing on your face and everything else. So I really hope that you enjoyed this video. Tell me down below if you tried She Glam before. I would love to know and make sure to go check out my powder video that I did uh, a while ago. Don't remember when, but I did. <laughs> it's gonna be up here somewhere. And make sure to, again, like the video for some, you know, engagement. Thank you so much to everybody that does this. Also comment down below if you did try She Glam before and make sure to subscribe to my channel for some content every single week on beauty, lifestyle, reviews, and a whole lot more. So I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching and I will definitely see you in the next one.